Welcome back to another video. Dog, I've never used this character. You know how I've said I've used Kaya at least once and that was inside of beta? I've never used Ning Wong. I did like a couple basic attacks with her and I just did not like her. So I, I put her right on the bench and she's forever been on the bench. Now I finally leveled her up because you guys absolutely destroyed the like button. So here's my Ning Wong's build and I literally just stole this from other people. By other people, I mean other characters. I literally just took their artifacts. So here's her HP flower, here's her feather, here's her sands of time, here's her cup, and here's her helmet. Weapon, talents, there goes extra stats if you want that. Now, I am using the four-star book instead of the five-star one, and that's because I'll just swap back and forth with TT and Ning so I can get the little boost that I want. And I might stumble over my words a bit because I bit my tongue. That's it hurting. All right, let's test this on some weak enemies first. All right, awaken. That's not what I, I, I aimed at the wrong. He's still just sleeping. Never mind. No, shoot through the, shoot through the wall. No. The, no, the wall. No. The wall. No. The wall, <laughs> Ning Wong. Shoot through the wall. No. I'm not shooting through the wall. Okay, there we go. Now I'm shooting through the. I'm not shooting through the wall. Can I? Can I like hold this and place this? No, I can't. Why do you gotta be such a sussy baka? What if I just do a hell attack? Boring. What if I uh, do this and then do my ult? What? I don't know, man. Ning Wong just feels... Uh, it's most likely because I am using the wrong stuff. Maybe I gotta pass through here in order to get the buff? Or is it just shoot through here? No, let's let's swap this. Okay, Haley Charles, I need to test something on you. Damn! Okay, I just hit like a 20k, and I, I want to know what that was. What was that 20k that I hit just now? Is this... Oh, yo, that E is crazy. What does that even do? Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, let, let's try this. I think that my E is probably the most coolest thing I have. I mean, like, I know that Ning Wong is really good if you know how to build her and build her the right way. But Ning Wong is just so underwhelming for me. I, I don't know. The fuck? God damn it, I didn't crit. There we go. That was a nice crit. 27. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, man. This is... Am I doing something wrong? Let me let me test it on Child. Let me see if it'll work on him. Yeah, I... I, I honestly don't know. Can't catch me, fat bitch. Am I getting fucking tossed around? Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna... Okay, stop, stop, stop! Chi Chi and Ning Wong almost died. All right, new plan. So, in conclusion, Ning is just boring. I don't I don't think she's great by herself, so we're gonna slap in Noelle. She's just gonna be there to be there. In fact, Noelle literally has nothing, so she cannot deal damage. And here's her weapon. <laughs> uh, we're just gonna break another Geo. Oh. Oh, Beto's dead. If uh, we still deal, like, no damage, I'm just gonna slap Bennett on there and call it a day. Okay, we're starting off with 20k. I'm about to die. Okay, 14k health attack. That's not bad. What is going on? What is going on? Hey! This is still underwhelming. All right, time to bring out Bennett. One of the very, very rare times I'll actually use a buff. All right, let's uh, let's do this. Hitting. Okay. Oh Big god. numbers. Oh. That you did game oh. non crit. Oh my god. Oh, 26 k health attack. Yeah, this is still pretty goddamn underwhelming. I'm gonna be honest with you. Well, I have to admit, hitting a 26k basic attack or held attack is not bad at all. My question is now, what is my ultimate gonna do? And for me to find out, I need Bennett's ult. Mm. Under a rock hit for like 14k. Not bad. Gonna visit some old buddies over here. Hey, buddy. If I can, if I can just crit, that, that'd be cool. Nope, still not critting. Do this again. Still not critting. Oh, he died. I just can't crit at all. Oh, wait, I didn't. God damn it. Okay, let's. No, I just used. To... I'm an idiot. Oh, my attack crit. Okay, the small rock. No, hell, attack crit. No, no, crit. I just I just can't crit, can't I? Can rocks put out fire? I gotta be here all day. Holy. Are you kidding me? 
Hey, 28k from my uh, E. Uh, that's cool. I, I literally cannot crit. I, I can't crit on my goddamn basic attacks, though. I wonder if I can break this. I can. It's really easy to break. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. That's that's actually not bad. Okay, with buffs. Well, with buffs, anyone can be good. But you know, I'm not, not going to lie, though. On the bright side, even with buffs, she hits, like, pretty amazing numbers with just her basic attacks. But like, even though all she does is throw rocks at people, I got to say... For solo, Ning is just not it. If you have the right team with the right builds and buffs, then yeah, Ning is good. But buffs make anyone good. And I'm pretty sure almost everyone have been it. I, I won't say everyone because I know everyone does not have been it. But I would say most people have been it. So I, I would say it's safe to use been it, right? Right? Boom. So look at that. That stuff there is cool. Her E is very cool. Hell's attack, extremely cool. That is some nice damage. The more I look at that, the more I like Ning. Can you please not do that? I need my ult. See that? Crazy. Absolute. That that right there was insane. See, now we're dealing major damage. Why the hell am I on 385 HP? What is going on? I would say it's pretty easy to hit numbers with Ning Wong. If you're not an idiot and, you know, only use one character and one character only instead of a team-based game, I feel like you can deal damage with anybody. Except for a certain person whose name I shall not say. Without Bennett's <laughs> ult. What just happened? None of the- I just did not crit at all there. My- my game didn't want to let me crit at all. What was that? I would say even without Bennett's ult there, that was really good. Hey there. She is getting tossed around like a rag doll. Oh my god. That's the kind of fun I want to have. See, now Ning Wong is feeling great. My tongue really hurts. Let's do this. No, I used the wrong guy! Where did she go? My rocks went all over the place because they didn't even know where she was. What was that? Please, for the love of God, just crit. This is actually, this is, this is insane. This is insane. Now you want to crit. Now you want to crit. Did you know I uploaded to my second channel? Yeah, crazy. Go in the link in the description and uh, sub to my second channel if you want to be an absolute giga chat and see me play other games. All right, no buff, just geo res. Let's see how this works. <laughs> See, now that's really good. Yeah. To be able to hit 10k per little rock, really, really good. That had to been at least 20k damage. What? Let's see how Ning handles with crowd control. I really wish Ning Wong could attack faster. Not gonna lie, though. My opinion about Ning has slightly changed. After seeing her with the Geo res, I think putting another Geo inside of the team was really the key of dealing more damage. Gotta go! There's no way in hell he was in iframes, right? There, there, there's no way in hell he was in iframes. Okay, so in conclusion, Ning Wong really isn't that bad. It's just, I just can't like her that much, mainly because her playstyle just isn't fun her animations are super super boring and super super basic damage wise she's okay with the right team setup so i i don't i don't have any problem with ning wong except for her animations i will say that my views on ning wong is a little better though if you enjoyed the video leave a like and if you didn't take your anger out on the like button and sub button with that being said i will see you next time